Hey, what's going on everybody? It is uh, Tuesday now and I'm at work and I just, I don't like filming anything at work. I just, just showed my time. I am on break for the record. <laughs> uh, today's gonna probably be a snow day so I'm not sure if I'll have any time to vlog anything when I get home. So this is just in case. So, cause uh, I am plowing and so the snow is about to start soon and I just want to get something in because again, I want to try to do something every single day because what has been happening when I was doing weekly, like I was saying yesterday, is you get lazy and when I'm go, because I have such a crazy schedule with the kids and everything like that and with work, I'm usually exhausted when I come home and if I don't have to do something, I'm probably going to choose not and I'm going to trick my brain into thinking I don't have to and nothing's going to get done. That's why there wasn't a video last week. I pretty much just, I pretty much just summed up what I was saying yesterday. So hopefully I'll be able to record something uh, after the storm. Hopefully I'm not home that late. It's not supposed to snow that much. But just in case I don't, this is what I'm doing. So motion sickness is my Achilles heel for sure. I've had it since I was really young, and it's gotten better. However, it still can happen, and I know when I plow, I need to take it because the first few times I ever plowed, I ended up getting really bad motion sickness from the forward and back motion because every time you push snow you reverse and that was enough to make me really sick so i actually had to end up going home and that's just a horrible time to drive home in a snowstorm while you're pulling over to get sick <laughs> uh so but took dremamine and everything's good to go now so that is good and i'm really really hoping jack and eli don't have that experience because uh it's not fun being one of the few people that can't go on amusement park rides because you get motion sickness. And I even got motion sickness when I was uh, after skydiving. I was fine falling. I didn't mind jumping part. <laughs> uh, but after I landed, like my equilibrium couldn't balance out and I just get motion sickness and I'm bad. Some people can say go on a boat, get seasick, but then as soon as they hit dry land and flat land, they can shake it off me. I have to sleep it off. I need to sleep and, and re, I guess everything needs to recalibrate. So for me, it, it really knocks me down. Like I'll turn sheet white, my body starts shaking, I get tingles everywhere. And yet I just get sick and like I said, until I can sleep it off. But anyway, like I said, I'm just filming this just in case I don't have time to film later. Cause like I said, plan is to vlog every single day. All right, I'm home and the adrenamine worked. I didn't get sick. Hey, what's up, you lad? Eddie's home. Yay! Hey, Jack. How you doing, pal? Yeah? Did you just get a bath? Yeah, did you have a shiny hiney? Oh, yeah! Shiny! All right, so it's a few hours later. Uh, the kids were starting to freak out, and I didn't want to film that. And so we fed them and everything like that. And so I'm a little behind. Actually, I'm a lot behind. Uh, with vlogging and editing and I wanted to edit faster because I had the footage on my phone today but trying to edit that my PC doesn't like the, the footage so I had to render it out um, I'm working on my timeline I had to take a whole clip and render it out which takes time and then put it back in the timeline so it works better so needless to say I'm running out of time to get this done and I don't really have a story yet but needless to say, I got home, I did not get sick, although I didn't have to plow that long, but I did take Dremamine, so I was good to go. And no one threw up today, which is great. <laughs> I think I'll end the vlog opening some mail that I ordered. All right, so I got a new tripod, uh, well, I should say switch pod. It's a replacement of the Joby Gorilla Pod, which I was using. And that tripod, when you put the camera on it, it was not sturdy at all. I think it, most people, if you look at reviews, most people would review it as saying it's excellent for like the first couple weeks, maybe a month. And the weather, I think, has a, something to do with it. But then, like, the little joints start getting real loose, and you're gonna start seeing your camera, like, you'll start risking having your camera fall. So, I finally went out and got a switch pod. It was a hundred bucks on Amazon. Plus I got the little ball head um, that came with it. And 
which basically enables you to be able to move it, uh, move the camera a lot better when it's when it's stationary. So as you can see, it opens up, it closes, and like this little flippy mechanism sort of way. Um, really easy, really simple. It's not that heavy. As you can see, the way I'm holding it, it's designed for vlogging, and it's very sturdy, and I like it so far. And when you have your camera on it, it's very sturdy. Very, very sturdy. And uh, hopefully, it'll last me a long time longer than the Joby did. Alright, so this vlog was all over the place, and I ran out of time to really turn it into anything good. But now, it's going to be about how I got a new tripod for my vlogging gear. And I'm going to leave it at that. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. I hope to get better at these. That's the main goal. And uh, again, main goal is to do one every single day. So like me, create something awesome today. Stay well, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.